I know you might be interested in that spot that's highlighted for possible development, a low chance of development in the Gulf. And again, we're kind of watching over here right now for where that low pressure is. We've also had, if you looked earlier, a kind of big upper low spinning some moisture toward our part of the Gulf Coast over the weekend. But what we're going to see is this moving across Florida, getting into the northern Gulf, and there is officially a low chance of development right now from the National Hurricane Center. They started highlighting this yesterday for a low chance of development. Really what we're expecting, even if this were to develop or try to take on some tropical characteristics, at the end of the week, we're talking about really the main thing I think would still be rainfall, just rain and uh, a few rounds of it, perhaps Thursday and Friday along the northern Gulf Coast, including our area. Now you can see that low pressure and the big slug of tropical moisture. This is by Thursday riding over our part of the Gulf Coast, moving inland. So even by Saturday, we will see how long into the weekend we keep the chance for those tropical rains around. But it does look like there will be a good chance of rain probably Thursday, Friday, perhaps into Saturday, and then easing by Sunday. So it's really just a late in the work week and maybe into Saturday kind of concern for any sort of flooding rain or rounds of rain. Here's our model. If you're just interested in one model, this is the European model, a great model showing a low pressure crossing into the Gulf, and this is by Tuesday. So you can see there is some low pressure here. There's also a big high that actually will make it really hot for us on Tuesday. Tuesday, not a big rain chance for us at all. Hotter and drier for us. But here's that low getting into the Gulf. Now it's a broad low. You can see it is not tight. It is not showing a whole lot of rotation, but you can see low pressure with rain, especially perhaps on the eastern and northern side of that low. Now this is by Thursday. It gets close to our coast and then gets a nudge inland as we move into Friday. So you saw no really a very strong tropical kind of look with anything with the Euro. The GFS also not really aggressive at all with developing it but rather just bringing that low pressure into the Gulf and bringing the rainfall. So how much rain we're ta talking in the blues and purples about maybe up to two or three inches. Now this is very preliminary. We'll have to see how it takes shape, but I would plan on at least some rounds of rain, especially Thursday and Friday. The flooding rain outlook on Wednesday and Thursday, you can see it's just the marginal out of the four risk categories for flooding rains, but we'll see how many of these rounds we're expecting and we'll get a better idea in the next couple of days once that load does get into the Gulf and we see what we're dealing with a little better.